Good morning guys, it's 6.14 on Monday. I actually feel pretty good this morning, even though last night, first of all, I did not sleep well. I mean, I slept six hours, but like, not straight, you know? I was up at like, I don't know, 3 a.m. I didn't go to sleep till like 11, which is a little bit later than I would like because like yesterday, I said to my dad, I was like, I want to try to go to bed earlier so that I'm not as cranky in the morning. Just also so that I just feel better because also to be healthier because you got to go to sleep early because like that's it's important. And I know it's what a lot of people struggle with, including myself, is going to bed earlier. And I talked to him about it. I was, I was like, that's a really good idea. And I was like, yeah, I want to do it. And then... <laughs> I didn't go to bed till way later than I wanted to, but I am going to make myself go to bed by 10 o'clock every night now. Like 9.30, 10 o'clock, that's when I'm going to try to go to bed. I mean, I'll, it, first of all, it depends on how much homework I have, but I'm not going to make myself stay up past like 10 o'clock. And I'm going to try to get my work done like as soon as I get home. I'm going to do as much editing, as much editing as I can on the bus, and then have Zachary help me if I have a lot of homework to do, because he, he likes to edit. Plus, he never, he never has as much homework as I do, obviously, because he's in fifth grade, and I have a lot of homework to do a lot of the time, and this week, especially, this is midterms week, so I'm going to have a lot of studying to do, so... This is definitely really gonna, really gonna have to help me out, so, yeah. And I also want to talk about something else really random. I'm just gonna change the subject really randomly that I, about things I've been thinking about because, like, I want to, like, share them, and I don't want to forget, so I'm just gonna say it now. But, like, I haven't realized that, like, how, po how much posture is such a good exercise because, like, on days where I like wear tighter things, you know, and you want to like, you know, sit up straight so that your stomach's in when you wear tighter clothes, you know what I mean? And I just find whenever I wear tighter things and then I, I sit up straight all day, then I, I, it actually feels like I've done like an ab workout because it really is an ab workout just to sit up straight. I, I, cause at the end of the day, when I take my dress off, I'm just like, whoa, it feels like I've just done a really intense hat workout, even though all I've done is sit up straight, you know? And this morning, I feel very motivated for some reason to, like, work out, so I might just, um, oh my gosh, but first of all, let's look at this. Uh, we're, ca like, counting down. I, like, spray my pillow at night now, like, I'm not trying to, like, get rid of this, but, like, I am. <laughs> This is lasting way longer than I ever thought. Oh, I love you, Bath and Body Works. Okay, why do I keep changing the subject like that? Okay, anyway. What was I gonna say? What was I saying? I forget. If I remember, then I'll say it. Oh yeah, I feel very motivated right now to work out. So I might, like, go downstairs, put my my oatmeal in the microwave, because that's what I want for breakfast. Put my oatmeal in the microwave, and then run down to the basement and then run back and forth do a plank basic exercises like that but like in the basement so that I don't disturb anyone yeah I'm gonna try to do a makeup I'm gonna try to do a makeup really fast today because like I don't want to spend a lot of time on it and it's already 618 and I actually want to get downstairs by 620 so I'm just gonna do my makeup now Just to give you an idea, 
Hey guys, it's 2.53. It is pouring outside and uh, we're in the parking lot for the doctor's office. I'll go to the doctor about my stomach. And we we're gonna like stop home, but we're like, no. I don't wanna get out of this car more than I need to, right? We're gonna get like an inch of rain. Yeah, that, that's fun. But while we're sitting here, I'm probably gonna edit yesterday's video. No, my penguin, no! Hey guys, it's currently, I don't know what time it is. What time is it? It is. What time is it? It's on 5.23. 5.23. I have potato in the, in the oven. I have rice, barley, the, the stuff, in the microwave. That's gonna be my dinner. I had a smoothie earlier. I didn't even finish it. I'm playing knockout. I think it was the first time I ever not finished a smoothie, but I, like I finished most of it, right, Zach? Most of it. Yep. I might have a bagel too because I hadn't really eaten much today. I just had, cause like I had my breakfast, which was oatmeal with applesauce and maple syrup. And I went to the doctor, and they said there was nothing really wrong with me. It was just, I forget what the term was, but it was like, after having a stomach virus, which Zachary and I did, then it just takes a long time for it to, for me to recover and stuff. <sighs> but that's, it's definitely getting better. I, but I'm really kind of sick of boring food, to be honest with you. <laughs> but, yeah, this is what I'm eat for dinner. I'm going to... Try a little bit of ketchup on the side. I'm not gonna smother my rice in it. I'm gonna put lemon juice on that. And I'm gonna like dip my, my potato fries into some ketchup, some mustard, some maple syrup. I'm just, I'm, 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 going to, I'm just trying to just to slowly incorporate more. What's the next step? Salsa? More like spices, you know? Like turmeric? Yeah. Basil? I yeah. Basil. This is an herb, not a spice. Ah, yeah. And then I have my music lesson of grade three. So videos edited. Zachary edited it. <laughs> edited it. Most of it. I edited some of it. I edited. I edited like a quarter of it. And he edited like three quarters. But he like you know he's like he he likes this stuff. Listen, listen. One second. Against his girlfriend. Ha! AC. Suck it. Oh, I just thought I'd give you guys that update. And, um, yeah. Do you mind throwing this box away? Out. I've, no! But after, oh, three, two. After my voice lesson is the bachelor. And then in between the commercial breaks, I do my workout. Woo! While I'm eating my dinner, I'm going to uh, do my homework. I don't have that much homework. But I'm ready to eat. I'm hungry. I'm hungry now. I wasn't earlier. I'm going to put it in my beautiful bowl. And if you follow me on Snapchat, you would know I have my ritual. Every night I post my dinner. I put a picture of my dinner on my Snapchat now. So go follow my Snapchat. P-E-Z-Z-O-E-7-7. Little self promo there. And follow mine. But follow Zachary. It's Zach Frenchman. I'll put it in the description. Because Zachary got his Snapchat like not even a week ago. I'll leave that in the description along with mine. My, uh, mine's always in the description. All my social medias are always in the description. So go follow them on all my nice. social medias for some pictures and stuff. Nice. Yeah. Oh.
Hey guys, it's 10.03. I'll finish the bachelor. It just ended. I know my hair looks like in this disgusting bun thing at the moment. But I was just, I worked out during the commercial breaks, if you, if you could tell. I washed my face. And it is 10.04, so I'm going to go to bed soon. But I didn't really vlog much today. I kind of failed a little bit. I mean, I got like 11 minutes worth of footage. <laughs> Why am I talking like this? Maybe because I just watched The Bachelor and I just watched Raven talk a lot. Okay. If you watch it, you know what I mean. You know what I was talking about. Okay, but I... I worked out throughout. Oh, this this is like perfect. I just put it like on here. This one. That's good. This looks so empty, guys. Doesn't it look so empty? Yeah, I have to remove that the shelf from here soon. That is vanilla bean oil stuff. That is this jar I got from Target. No giant. And there's like some yeah, winter stuff. I gotta put that away. That is my magazine basket. That is a bag with a Hanukkah presents that I got from my aunt and uncle. It's like this, this vegan soap shampoo conditioner. Actually, I showed you guys about my, what I got for Hanukkah. Well, that is my nightstand with my books and some crap in there that I should probably clean out soon. Calendar. Z, uh, like, what's it called? The, the bulletin thing, I think, yeah. That is my tray with my candles and my owl sculpture. And, or like, it's not really a sculpture. You guys know what that is. Uh, some mason jars, my Christmas basil plant picture. I don't, I don't know why I'm giving you guys like a weird kind of tour. But this kind of looks kind of empty right now just because of this. But I, I kind of like it because I, even though I just need to clean up this area. <laughs> that was really weird. And then this stuff was my winter stuff there. Ugh. I already drank a full one of these and I'm on my second and I'm almost done. My video went up at like 9, 10 I think. Which was good. Like I was doing video stuff and working out during the commercial breaks. I'm always just so productive during the commercial breaks if you didn't already know that, which some of you probably did. Uh, I'm, I'm thinking of wearing my hair up tomorrow. Obviously not like this, like in an actual like ponytail, but I hardly ever wear my hair up just because I hate wearing my hair up. I always think it looks bad. I always think my hair looks bad. <laughs> I mean, some days I have really good hair days, I'm not gonna lie, but I also have really bad hair days. And hopefully, hopefully tomorrow will be an okay one at least, if not a great one. But one can only hope. Yeah, I haven't really done much today. As you guys know, my Mondays are just kind of like, come home, make food and eat, do homework, make dinner, eat. <laughs> music, singing lessons, come home, bachelor, in between the commercial breaks and get stuff done. So, uh, yeah, so, nothing really too exciting. What's going on tomorrow? Tomorrow's Tuesday. And I definitely want to start just like gradually changing my routine a little bit. Waking up a little bit earlier, going to bed obviously a little bit earlier. So after I'm done, with this for a couple more minutes, then I'm gonna go to bed. I'm gonna put this on top of my tray here that I have here, where my laptop goes. Got my clothes picked out, and uh, I'm just gonna, I just wanna get, get through my morning routine stuff quickly. I'm gonna wake up a, a little bit earlier just so I can work out. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do what I did today. Oh, yes, the uh huh. The, well, I kind of liked it, just doing a little bit of a workout with the little bit of time I have. But I'm going to start doing that in the morning. And, uh, yeah. 
just changing up my morning a little bit so I can add in some more physical activity because that's good. And tomorrow I have gym and gym and I love gym and I always go as tough as I can in gym. We had a free, whenever we have free gym periods, a lot of the girls just sit on the bleachers and go on their phones and stuff while the guys just like play some basketball or something. I run across. I run in circles. I last gym class I taught my friends some Pilates moves, so I'm pretty proud of myself with that. So, and whenever we play games, I go hard, and our warm ups, I go hard, because our warm ups are just like running and then just and then like jumping on one foot, and I don't know what these are called, but where you do 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 do. These are your legs. <laughs> if that makes sense. Uh, I, maybe I'll show you guys that at some point, I don't know. Uh, we do some planking and some leg lifts and no one, n no one actually does them. Except for me. I'm like the only girl in my gym class. Like, it's, most of the guys don't even do it either. But I, don't, I know I'm like the only girl in my gym class that actually does the exercises because I think, I know that exercising is extremely important. And I have no idea what I'm going to title this video because this is just a bunch of random stuff I'm talking about. Maybe I should go to bed now. I seem like, I feel like I'm a little too uh, energized right now for, and I should be tired. And I also need to go to the bathroom. Okay, I'm going to end this video here so I don't, so I can just go to bed. I think I need to, I need to settle down. And I have my, my uh, math midterm. Tomorrow, another French part of my midterm. We, today's part was listening and reading. It was so easy. Our French midterm is divided into four sections. Writing, which was on Friday that I have to make up. But um, all my friends got like 100 on that, so I'm not too worried. Uh, writing, and then listening and reading, which was today. Tomorrow, speaking, which is really easy. You just give us a scenario and you talk about it. Like, it's not, it's not that hard. And I'm in math midterm, which I'm a little bit more worried about, even though I'm not going to lie. Um, last test I had in math, I failed. I, well, I got a D, and then I took the retest, and I got an F on the retest. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to try to hide that. I normally get good grades. I normally get okay grades. I normally get like B's and A's. Season, you know. Like, I have been struggling with math a lot this year. I'm not gonna lie, I think it's mostly because of the teacher. But I've been struggling a lot with math this year, and I was not very happy with that grade, obviously, and I really wanted to raise it. I mean, it only, I mean, it brought, like, I had an 80 in math, like, I was on the verge of a C. But then, this past test, I got an A on. And then it raised my grade, and I was happy. I was very happy, and my teacher literally like go, goes up to me and she goes, "Zoe, how did you fail the last test, and then you get an A on this one?" And I was like, "Bitch, like, why would you even ask me that? I studied. Why? How do you think I? Do? Whatever. Okay, whatever." Alright, now I'm just rambling about school. Alright, I'm gonna end this video here. If you like to give it a big thumbs up, make sure you hit that subscribe button and share this video and my channel to those you think might be interested and leave me comments down below. The comment of the day, what's your favorite emoji? I thought of that really quickly, partially because I looked at this that I made, like on a, it's on a DIY video, so basically it's the little emojis like pocket with like a bunch of pictures of emojis and then this is the mood that says mood and then he, he puts the picture my brother put that there when I was sick and I never changed it normally I have the winky face just like the happy one I don't know there's, there's angry and there's sad there's a lot of different emotions what's your favorite emoji? I think mine might be the laughing crying one basic I like the sweet potato one, and the rice one, and all the fruits and veggies ones, of course, and the penguin one, love that one. I don't know, I think that might be my favorites.
but I love emojis in general. But let me know in the comments what your favorite emojis are. If you don't, if you're like using a computer, then just like describe the emoji and I'll probably know what you're talking about. Okay. So uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. Love you. Bye.